takeaways from your first seven practices you've had? I think uh, last time we spoke, I think you know you can still see where our guys paid a lot of dividends this summer. Once you get into that first week, there's always those those little bumps and bruises and those little uh, lulls and high peaks and a little bit of valleys in practice. And I think that's that's pretty normal. And so we get to coach ourselves through those and teach through those and um, kind of really hone in on the process itself instead of the result. How would you describe what, what your quarterback room is like right now? Um, minus just an inexperience. Probably the best word. What led to Birch staying at quarterback? You put him in a red jersey I think, a couple days ago. What, what made the decision to keep him there? Well, first coach Taggart. And then we felt like uh, he was doing some really nice things as a, as a young guy in our room to build some depth. And um, we've enjoyed having him in that room. Second year, when you were playing, what was the, the biggest difference for you between your first year and second year when you started getting Like, basically, like, we're just in that. Yeah. That first year, that jump to that sophomore year, you make uh, at least, I felt like myself and then the guys over my career that have had that jump, you can make exponential jumps, leaps. Um, just being able for the game to slow down a little bit, you know, the maturity level. Uh, I don't think you've got it all figured out, but I think the game slows down a little bit and you get to to uh, work through some things. Obviously, having a coaching change in within that um, can be a little bit of an impediment, but I think it's worked out well. But was there a game for you where like you kind of just felt like, okay, you know, this this is coming to me slow, or like where where this is just different for you? You know, I don't know if there's a specific game. I just remember that year. Right. It was a was a different year. I felt better coming out of the weight room after a summer very similar to how his body's changed. Um, obviously, he's much bigger and better than I was, in my opinion. Um, but I think that I do remember that that difference I had in maturity for the game. Did Did you register between your? I did not. I started with true pressure. Okay, gotcha. Birch, the guy, who got the red Birch got the red jersey on. Now, is that a, a thought that he may? How's he looked and he came in as an athlete? Is that a spot you think he'll stay or is it kind of experimental? Yeah, I answered earlier. I think it's been a, it's been a good process for him this week. Um, coming in seven days in as a true freshman. <clears throat> is that a depth to our room? And uh, he's done a lot of nice things. I think we'll continue there until we feel we can add value in own. Does it look like the game is starting to slow down for these freshmen and these, these new faces? Is there a point, like, can you tell a weekend that the game is slowing down, they're starting to catch on? At times. At times, but they're drinking through a fire hose right now. You know, um, ninety percent of, for instance, the wide receiver room. Um, if Charles Nelson is out with a little bit of a ding, and Alex is out, um, if Dylan's out, every guy in that room raises their hand. They're in their seventh practice. <laughs> it is what it is. Get out there, roll it out, and let's go. Cut it loose. Have fun. How is school look so far? He's done a great job. It's been a few practices. He came in late. We're kind of in the middle of an install. So the way we install, we recycle installs. So he's kind of, he, we get back into the new one. He wasn't there for the first one. So, but he's done an awesome job. Effort, uh, he's displayed some really nice things outside that I think we're, that are gonna be valuable. And uh, every day is a, a great day for us to go out and really critique, critique him and uh, for him to critique himself. Has he blended in enough to where he's a receiver now? He's not gonna be back at all? He's, he's a vice here? That's corner office decision. I'm right in the middle. <laughs> he's there today. What's his role at the wide, in the wide receiver group? In this offense, run, catch, block. No blocky, no rocky. 